From the basketball courts to seeing her products on the courts, a local entrepreneur is paving the way for modest activewear. Sharon Yu caught up with Muna Mohammed to see how she's lifting the voices of anyone who practices modesty. I grew up playing basketball and then later went into coaching youth basketball at the Cedar Riverside. What Muna Mohammed observed on the courts. I remember certain games where a young girl would get frustrated. She would rip off her hijab, throw it to the side or just felt very uncomfortable leaving her values behind. She's lived it too. I definitely know that experience of layering up um, where I was wearing my basketball jerseys and shorts. I would wear undershirts under, try to figure out how to tuck in my hijab. After years of research, Mohammed created Kalsoni. Kalsoni is a lifestyle brand that creates inclusive activewear for Muslim women or any woman looking for a modest fit. From tunics of all lengths. We have like zippers everywhere where I also have zippers on the side. To sports shawls and hijabs, all items are built to not only make things easier without layering up and to build confidence. In my culture, Kalsoni means confidence. Um, the reason why I build my business around confidence, it's just like when you step into your brand new clothes and you feel that sense of confidence to take over the world. It's important for those who want to dress modestly to be reflective in the retail space. And really, it's been a slam dunk. Sports retailer REI carries Calsoni now, opening up to everyone. Is it like culturally appropriate for a non-Muslim woman to like wear Calsoni stuff? Yes, and that's where I want people to know it's not only for Muslim women. Modesty varies for everyone, um, and it's not only prevalent in the Muslim community. There's other communities that practice modesty, but it's not talked about here in the West. The hijab, yes, is for Muslim women, but for the activewear top, there's a lot of different coverages, and it's just inclusive for everyone. Mohammed's ultimate goal is for everyone to be active in a way they want, in what they want. Clothing was the number one barrier to Muslim women, specifically East African girls, um, and being physically active. So it was just beautiful to see people come to the gym wearing my clothing or around the lake wearing my clothing. And it's really beautiful to see it um, more inclusive and is just building a brand here in Minnesota. Well, you can find her items at calsoni.com and as she mentioned, REIs across the state.